Welcome to IBC 2023. Discover game-changing innovations, explore new business models, and network with over 170 countries. Exploring groundbreaking innovation across 13 halls, right here in Amsterdam. Ashley within broadcast, I'm joined by Susanna of Cobalt. Hello. Hello, how are you? I'm very good, thank you. So tell me, where does Cobalt stand right now in the media and broadcasting market? Well, we've, uh, we've been very fortunate to be able to make some good choices, really following customer requests. So we've been able to follow uh, the uncompressed world uh, very nicely, uh, and then we switch to compressed, we go after IP, we have several 2110 products, 4K, um, we're able to have a very strong partnership with uh, Advanced HDR by Technicolor a few years ago, so we have a very strong, robust solution uh, on the SGR HDR conversion. Also following um, customer requests, got into the JPEG XS, uh, you know, part of the technology. Um, now we have here um, software-based products, new form factors for 17 years. We've been very well known for our open gear form factor and our part partnership in the open gear consortium. And um, at this show, we're actually uh, releasing several new products that are different form factors, again, to, um, to just respond to customer demand. So, very happy. And what trends are you noticing as far as your technology in the media and broadcasting market? We, we are seeing still a lot of SGI, a lot of SGI requests, a lot of big, large opportunities. We're seeing that customers want to do more with less. Um, so we, we keep uh, progressing with our software-defined solutions where we sell a base product with a million choices so customers can choose as they go and they can uh, adapt and adopt new licenses as, as they grow, really. Um, so our encoders, decoders, are, you know, you can buy the plain model and you can add everything up to 4K. HDR, RISC, protocols, SRT. And so what are you showcasing right now? What are you highlighting? What are your latest developments? Okay, so um, one of the big new things is our Wave product line. So uh, we've had routers in the open gear form factor, the, the cards, and at the show we're um, uh, unveiling the, the new router. It's a um, four racking unit, and it's um, we have 32 by 32 and 64 by 64 cross point solutions. Very robust unit, very high density and cost effective, and uh, very flexible. Um, we are pairing with the router. We're coming out with uh, wave control panels. So we're going to have four different models of control panels: two one rocky unit and two two rocky unit. We always have a more high end, which is the buttons are backlit with LCD dot matrix uh, display buttons, so it's a more it's a higher end type of control. And then we have the low end, more budget friendly for some you know for half of our market. Um, these units uh, have customizable customizable APIs, so we are already seeing a lot of customers that would like to use the control panels for you know to manage some other products from other vendors and other pieces of the network. So that's on the Wave product family. We also have a brand new IP multi viewer. This multi viewer was specifically designed for master control, supports all monitoring applications. Because it's fully software based, um, we're able to basically support all compressed and uncompressed IP inputs and all the protocols. So we support risk, simple and main profiles and SRT. RTMP, UDP, RTP, just, just about anything. And on the output, it, um, it, it takes out multiple uh, outputs, including um, automatic uh, portrait rotation or any anything, really. So it's extremely flexible. We sell it as a software package. We sell it as a cloud instance with WebRTC outputs. And we also sell it uh, on, a, on a very cost-effective server type of products, people want the hardware. And last I'm going to mention is the, the new ultra low latency uh, decoder. So that's our new open gear card and it's part of the Pacific compression line. Um, the ultra low latency decoder is going to be at a much lower price point, but much more complete, a lot more features, and um, achieves uh, subframe latency. Um, between our encoder and our decoder, and um, supports, of course, all the IP protocols, 
and um, two or four channels of HVC and uh, one, one 4K channel. So that's also something that customers have been asking for us and you know we have a big background in compression so this is some of the some of the news there's always lots to talk about so Absolutely. and so for those that want to know more please go to their website and check that out and thank you for so much information and letting us be over here we always love talking to you thank you we love seeing you Ashley thanks for coming by thank you